She looks like. Not a horse. <laughs> you can quite go as far as over the legs. <laughs> I have an idea. I'm not sure it's a good idea. I've got an idea. It's an idea that probably would have been better to do two weeks ago than now. What my idea is, okay. So we've got this Hero Session 5. And we got this Hot Wheels car that it uses as a mount. And I got a bunch of Hot Wheels tracks. Now we have a few videos on the channel where we've tried to cross the pool with it um, on different floats and things like that, running along the pool deck with it, uh, running it down some stairs out into the yard, and then uh, one big one where one of our mini Aussies decides to wander away with it. Uh, so we've got a bunch of different videos like that, but our pool is still frozen. And I thought maybe it'd be kind of cool to run the Hot Wheels car across the frozen pool. It's a view no one gets because you don't go down on the pool when it's frozen, especially when it's partially melting, because it's not safe. Maybe we can run the car across. Now, that being said, I had that idea about a week ago, and um, it just hasn't been great to be outside to try it. Now, I'm still thinking about trying it, but I'm going to go look at the pool right now and see, because I'm thinking the ice has melted way more than I want it to. A few things, like I don't want the uh, the camera to fall into the pool and be there for like three weeks before we can fish it out, that kind of thing. I mean, it's waterproof, so it should be okay, but why take that risk, right? So there's that. Plus, a melting pool is the most dangerous pool. It's not frozen. It's not open. If you happen to fall in, you're struggling trying to get around the ice to get back out. It's not safe. So I want to go take a look at the pool and see if it's possible to do what I want to do. Maybe there's an edge or a side of it we can do it on uh, that's a little bit more safe, where we can be safer to do it. We'll definitely keep the dogs inside if we do it, because we don't want them running around chasing it and maybe ending up in the pool, and that'll be bad. So take every safety precaution we can, but right now I just want to take a look and see if we can do it or not. And then um, I'll have to decide to the GoPro, the uh, the Hot Wheels tracks we have just kind of snap together like this. And we got to run it across the whole pool, and I'm wondering if that's a strong enough connection or not. Uh, if it's not, I might have to tape the tracks together, and that's going to take some prep time. So that's some investigating I need to do, and uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. Okay, so here's the pool. Here's my concern. As you can kind of tell that it's uh, maybe I'll tell on camera. But yeah, the ice is starting to break up already. It's March 21st. It's early for this to occur in the pool. And uh, yeah, it's it's breaking up. It's not very thick. I'm concerned about stuff going through. Yeah, I can see over here that it's breaking up already. And uh, yeah, it's kind of weird early time. Melting earlier than expected. And uh, you can kind of see the pool is an ugly color underneath. We're gonna have to get a pump in there and throw some chlorine and get it circling so it doesn't get nasty on us, but uh, it's probably later today. But today's been kind of a, not a great day uh, for weather. It's a little, uh, it's been rainy and stuff like that, it's okay now. So I might be okay on this side, that's what I'm thinking. I might be okay to run the track along this side. It's thicker, thicker ice. So I'm gonna put together some track and just see what happens. But yeah, being extra safe, because I do not want to fall in. Okay, so I got all the track laid out. Gonna have to try and slowly slide it onto the pool. Kaya's here to help me. Okay. But uh, yeah, being very careful. Being very careful. <laughs> yes, so yeah, we'll see how it goes. So the idea is I'll uh, probably start the car at the far side over there and run it this direction. Now I don't, I don't think I'll be able to get enough momentum on it to make it come back up the hill. Yeah, probably not. So that's a little... Uh, disappointing. Disappointing. It probably means I should have done this about a week ago when I could put more effort behind it. But right now, if I fire it off the end too hard, it's... Uh, probably going to fall off. Well, it's going to fall off and it might fall in underneath the ice and it's gone for a few weeks until it melts enough to get it. So we don't want that. So. We'll give it a try. I think first I will do just a standard Hot Wheels car as a test once we get it in line uh, and then go from there. Ready, Kai? Yeah. Let's see how quickly I can get this test car to disappear, <laughs> is my guess. Okay, you're on the track. 
give it a go. That's a bad sign right off the hop. Okay. So I'm just going to have to yet let gravity do it. Giving it a push is going to cause a problem. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to get stick, uh, pool net, and dig that out. Okay, got the car. Rescued it with the, the net. Uh, now, okay, I'm just going to try gravity, essentially. So it does pretty good. So that's not bad. With the extra weight from the uh, GoPro camera, it probably is pretty good. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to fish that off and we'll try it with the GoPro. Okay, rescued the car again. And we got, we had to do some uh, cleaning up on the track just to put it back together. But yeah, now we're ready for the actual Hot Wheels car. I'm going to hit record. Make sure it's going. That is going. And let's see what she looks like. <laughs> Didn't quite go as far as I would have liked. <laughs> Didn't quite go as far as I would have liked. That's for sure. That's for sure. Interestingly enough, it doesn't sound like it's running. It's almost got a little... Squeaky? Squeaky, yeah. So it's like one of the wheels is not turning as well as it like. Because uh, yeah. it's been in it's been in water before and I bet it's rusting a little bit. Yeah. So we might not get as good a shot. But we'll give it another go here. Okay, we're recording again. It's all good. Oh, that's that good. Not good. <laughs> that don't work. Okay, I'm gonna rescue that recording again. It's all good. That don't work. Car is rescued. Okay. Rescued the car again. Cleaned the track up a little bit. And let's try gravity again. I think we're gonna have a problem. Back wheel, I just kind of tested off camera. It's got a little bit of a squeak. So I think, yeah, you can hear that, hopefully. Yeah. So yeah. I mean, at least it went a bit farther than last time. Mm-hmm, squeak. I think. Okay, so proof of concept, we're gonna have two major issues. Uh, well, maybe three actually. Uh, one is that the ice is melting way faster than we want, so it uh, could be dangerous to put the car right in the center, uh, but we, we gave it a try. Uh, so yeah, it's, uh, so that's one of the issues. The other issue is the car has a little squeaky wheel. I'm gonna try and loop that up. Uh, tomorrow's supposed to be sunnier. So we'll give it again another try again tomorrow once I've cleaned that wheel up and hopefully that'll help. And uh, yeah, the third issue is because we've got that big gap the pool's being winterized, it's not full. That's too far a gap down and then we lose too much momentum across the pool to climb back up on the other side. And I can't give it a really good push and have it stay on the track so it makes it all the way through. So yeah, without some kind of external source to push it through, that's not going to work. Uh, tomorrow, if the weather cooperates and it's nice and sunny like it's supposed to be, we'll try some more stuff. Okay, sun is shining. Sun is shining. Uh, it's the day two of attempting to do this. I uh, get this car, GoPro car, across the pool. So, yeah. Couple of freezing again last night, pretty good. Just above freezing right now. So it's uh, a little bit more solid looking than it was yesterday. But uh, got a short window here before it starts to really warm up today. And uh, uh, we start probably 
losing any kind of chance at all of making this work. So I'm going to give it a bit more of a try and I'll just get some stuff set up and see what I can do. Okay. Yesterday's attempt, we went over on this side, um, gave sharper slope to come up. So this is a little bit more gradual slope. We'll see what happens there. But because the pool is a little bit more frozen than it was yesterday right now, I'm not as concerned about losing the the, <laughs> the car and camera down in under the ice quite yet. Um, give me about an hour and the pool will be more melted and yeah, I would be concerned. So I'm going to give this a try now, see what we can do and see what it's going to look like. see what kind of footage I got from there but hopefully I got something good short video at least maybe some nice thing for YouTube shorts but yeah cool thank you for watching see you in the next one